Hey everybody, this is Facia with Simply Lavish at Home and today I am excited because I am sharing with you my Christmas tree. If you follow me on Instagram, you already got a sneak peek so you see that the theme this year is peacocks and I absolutely adore it. I actually came up with the theme last year and want to share it with you today. Um, here are the materials that I use. You can see that I have a variety of size ornaments. I have my wreath and garland basket in the back. Um, my Christmas tree, which isn't a very expensive Christmas tree at all, um, it is about seven feet tall. But the want to draw your attention to some of the things that I use. If we start to the left, you'll see those pairs of ornaments. Now, I actually got these last year from Five Below for a dollar fifty a pair. That's right, a dollar fifty a pair. I bought everyone in this color scheme that I found there. Um, I can't remember if I came up with the idea of peacocks first or I saw these and said peacocks because there's some purple ones, some, some that blue and that pink and it was absolutely perfect. So check out the or two containers of ornaments that I have there towards the back. The one on the left are from Michaels. And with a 50% off coupon, I want to say they were between $13 and $14. And there are 30 in the pack. They are unbreakable, shatterproof. And I, I got those. Then I went to Family Dollar and saw the container on the right. There's about 35 in there, all for $5. They are slightly smaller than the ones from uh, Michaels, but they're ornaments, still just as beautiful and they'll look good on my tree. So I got them both. And they both were just the perfect for my color scheme. Then I want to draw your attention to those two rolls. Um, those are wired mesh ribbon that I purchased from Joan Fabrics. And really check out how it is this perfect turquoise and green ombre color. I was like, hello. So I got two rolls and actually only use one roll on the tree and the other roll over my windows. And the star of the show are these floral picks in the shape of peacock feathers. Um, couldn't ask for better. A lot of the time when I pick up a theme, it takes me forever or I can't, simply just can't find what I want for the theme. But this year I got really lucky, found everything I wanted in the stores, no problem. So check out a few details on the tree there you see those large ornaments that I got that perfect ombre ribbon and also this ribbon with actual peacock feathers on them that I found pretty much at the last minute and couldn't ask for better again usually I can never find exactly what I need next year it'll all be there but this year I got really lucky so when I'm hanging ornaments I like to hang them in a variety of ways Sometimes I'll cluster them like you see those three are clustered there together. Um, I get a variety of floral picks again. Those are just regular floral picks that you see at the store. And that ribbon that I man maneuvered in and out of the branches. And when you're hanging ornaments, I also like to hang them at a variety of depths in the tree. So some might be further out on the branches, some might be tucked in a little closer. You'll also see that I have some picks that are feathers and just went with a variety of colors all fitting the theme, some purple, some green, some turquoise blue, and I love it all. Now I do use an artificial tree. Um, one is just easier for me, they're lighter than a heavy tree, so having to carry that up to my condo and back down again is really just easy and I use it to manipulate the branches and hold sometimes hold some of the ornaments you see that those branches bend so um, my technique sometimes if I'm being lazy is to use that to kind of pinch off the ribbons um, so we get that nice fluffy look that we like in those trees that we see here and in department stores and it just really gives it a nice depth of look. And you can also see that I used those same picks and things and the wreath. I don't even know why I set that ornament there. I just kind of did. I think I meant to hang it. 
but um, repeating some of those elements that are on the tree in my wreath. So I bought plenty of everything for it to go around, be able to spread it around. And even did some um, and wrapped some garland around the rim of my chandelier. Um, just to finish it off, tie it in together um, to make to complete the look. So do let me know what you think. Um, if you are not following me on Instagram, you missed out some on some sneak previews of the videos that I got coming up. So definitely follow me on Instagram. I'm also on Facebook and on Twitter. Links are in my biography and below. And hope you all are having a wonderful holiday season. Till next time, happy holidays. Here's to living simply lavishly. Cheers. Mm -hmm.